Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to show you a new feature where when you reference a calculation within a calculation, we simply now refer the calculation by name versus copying the complete expression of the reference calc. Let's take this example. I have a calculation that computes total revenue. It computes quantity ordered with gross unit price and then subtracts the discounts and shipping cost. Now I'm going to add another calculation that computes the profit value based on total revenue. So when I select total revenue, which is my calculation, we do not copy the expression of this calculation anymore, but we reference this calculation by name. Let me just complete uh, my expression. Total revenue minus profit is my profit value. Let's validate it and click save. Now, when you open up the calculation again, it's always referencing using the name of the reference calc within profit value in this case. So any updates to the total revenue calculation, let's just say that I'm gonna remove shipping costs from my expression here. And this change will now automatically flow to profit value calculation, simply because we reference it by the name and not by the expression. This is a huge improvement to the MyCalc experience when using nested calculations for your workbook use cases. The right-click operation for MyCalc shows two options to either copy the expression or copy the expanded expression. Let's copy the expression first to the clipboard. Uh, let's add a new canvas and I'm gonna add a text visualization and paste this expression. Copy expression does not bring in the expression or the formula of the reference calc. While copy expanded expression, let's copy that to clipboard and I'm gonna add a line item and paste. And you can see that this brings in the formula of total revenue along with other expressions that's available as part of the calc definition. Thank you for watching this video.